Hey guys, welcome back. I'm Scaredy Jew, and today we are going to be hopping into another indie horror game, Astral Abyssal. Now, this game was created by a student of game design while at university and is heavily inspired by Iron Lung. If you remember, Iron Lung was a game that took place on a planet that was completely covered in blood, that we had to travel around alone in a submarine exploring the remnants of a lost civilization while being hunted by a mysterious monster. Well, this game is a similar concept, but with traveling the vast, dark abyss of deep space in search of the ability to save the human race. Uh, this game is free to play, so if you want to download it, it's each.io, and there's a link down in the description if you want to play it yourself. So sit back, put on your headphones, relax as we jump into the game Astral Abyssal. In the space where all stars are gone, what is left is only absolute darkness. Only lights from the past still linger for us to witness with our eyes. But a new local group was discovered, assuming to possess a single star in the entire observable universe. There might still be hope to find. You are to be deployed in an, observ in an observation space shuttle, tasked to reach this local group. Find the stars, observe, and find out anything that might bring the survival of humanity. Somewhere in this astral abyss, lights await. Oh, uh, okay. Let's see. Oh, shit. Playing audio recording. Message from command center to pilot. As you know, all observable stars disappeared centuries ago. We have been searching for a new light source ever since. A new local group has just recently been discovered. We called it Delta Local Group. We assumed that there could be a that there could be stars inside that local group. You are piloting an observation spaceship called the Orbiter. Your mission is to explore this local group and find a new star. By using astral radar, which can detect light particles. Your secondary mission is to document and collect data on anything you find. You can access various systems from control center, central panel in front. Okay. More instructions are located in guide manual. Menu. Okay, got it. Oh, wow. This is actually kind of cool. Not bad for a student making it. I kind of like the uh, PS1 style graphics. What's this? So, mission, select new destination. Ah, okay. Okay, before I do that, let's check this place out. Uh, don't know what that is. UTR system. Let's go downstairs real quick. We'll check downstairs first. I don't know how big this place is. Let's see. Oh, wow. Uh, oh, I have a flashlight. So what is this? Food? Oh, I can get food? Okay. Doesn't taste very good, but it keeps me alive. Drink. I'm feeling more refreshed already. Um, I don't see any bars or anything on me. Like health bar or anything like that. So I, d I guess that's just for, for play or for show. What's this? It's like a reactor core? Oh, what the hell? I feel like I'm, like, floating. Uh, this looks kind of like a reactor core. Oh. What the hell? Oh, they're spacesuits. Oh, shit, I forgot to put on a spacesuit. Oh, wait. What the hell? Oh, this is kind of cool. What the hell is this? It's like a, an observatory outside? Or is it like glass outside? Space lab terminal. Oh, status, scan, sample. Okay, so I'm guessing I pull things into the uh, orbiter and sample them. Okay, let's get out of here. Okay, up we go. Wow, that's kind of loud. Okay, in we go. What else are we looking at? Airlock doesn't open. 
I can't run, so that means I don't be ch I'm not chased by anything. That's good. What's this? Cryogenic station. I can't go to sleep without I can't go to sleep without selecting the next destination. Okay. So I guess I got to go up. Doesn't look like there's really anything else here. Let's close this because we know it's a horror game. I want that closed. Let's take a look. What's guide manual? Ship layout manual. Ah, okay. This is explaining to us how to do all this stuff. Okay, I think I'm going to skip this part for you guys. It's going to be really boring. It's basically just controls and stuff. Okay, this part would be good for you guys to know. This is the mission brief. This manual is a mission brief for the Orbiter Pilot. As you know, humanity has fallen into chaos centuries ago because of the sudden disappearance of the stars. Every star in the observable universe has disappeared out of existence. We still don't know how and why. What only matters is humanity is dying and we need to survive. You are sent to the new local group called Delta Local Group. The scientists predict that it might be a star inside. It might seem childish, but it's the only hope we have. Your mission is to find the star and collect new data throughout the journey. The dream is alive. Good luck with your search. Malin Dustin. Okay, I don't think there's anything else I can do. What's this? Uh, detected instance? Uh, I don't think it's letting me. Let's go back. Is it going to let me... Oh, there's nothing here. Okay, I guess... We select the destination? Oh, intercryogenic station. Okay, we already selected the destination. Alright, let's close this. So nothing goes up in our cockpit. And... This way, I think. Yep, here it is. Okay, to sleep we go. I don't know if I trust sleeping in something like that, but all right. I guess it would be really quick. Investigate area, data collection progress, zero. Oh, what's that? Ooh, the ambiance just picked up, the ambient noise. Oh, what the hell? Correct me if I'm wrong, but doesn't this wall look like it's kind of busted? Like something hit it? It wasn't like that before, was it? Yeah, it looks like something hit this shit. Oh my god. Okay, I guess we're gonna go upstairs and pilot. Oh, gotta press the button. Okay, let's close that. Oh, see? There's stuff now. Oh, destinations and stuff to go to. Let's see. Oh, okay, so that's like sonar? Oh, okay, so I gotta control it with this. I guess I'm going towards that red light. is that I'm hearing okay so there's the map what the hell is that a giant spear it's like moving weird the hell is this so I'm okay I'm analyzing it oh holy shit it has a eyeball that must be like a giant creature what the hell okay where the hell am I um okay so I'm in the middle I guess I gotta go somewhere else this is so confusing where the hell am I 
Oh wait, what's this? Okay, here we go. Moving forward. Let's get out of this weird eyeball socket. <laughs> oh, it's right next to me. Holy crap. Uh, this is kind of weird to navigate. Uh, ah, there we go. It looks like I'm pointing at it. Wait, this? No? Maybe it's something behind it. It's kind of weird. What? Oh, was it this? Maybe this weird thimble-looking thing? Oh, good. At least it gives me a proximity alarm if I'm close. Oh, okay. It's further down. So I must have missed it. Uh, go back. Come on. Okay, there. It's intersecting. I think that's it. Okay, so it is this. What the hell is this? It's like a box. A space station? Something? Huh. Alright, hold G. Okay, that's kind of weird. I guess there's nothing there. Oh, I gotta get to the thing in the distance. Okay. Let's see if I can aim at this. Gotta rotate. Okay, there. That's easier. Come on. Do I got it? Yep. There we go. It's aiming at it. Can't see shit. Oh, there we go. Okay, here. It's kind of interesting. Wow, this is dark. Oh, I'm not going the right direction anymore. I gotta go up. Uh, that looks like it's it. Okay, I guess I'm going for that point. Maybe? can't see where I am. I must be right next to it. Oh. Oh, shit. Okay. Damn, I can't see where I am. Those two colors uh, blend together. Oh, it's behind me. It's gotta be real close. Oh, shit, I'm looking the other way. Come on, rotate, rotate. Okay, there we go. Oh shit, it's right here. Okay, let's scan. No ob no objective detected. Okay, so we got it. Uh, where to now? What the hell is this thing? All right, I guess we gotta select the next destination. Okay, downstairs. Close this, don't want a monster getting in there. And I gotta go sleep, okay. Let's see where it takes us next. The navigation for this is actually quite interesting. Having to go back and forth like that. Investigate area. Okay, it's kind of dark in here. Yeah, it really does look like the ship was damaged somehow. It's like every time we go into the cryogenic sleep, the ship... Uh, oh, gotta open it. The ship ends up... Uh, going wonky on us. Like, we run in- we must be running into, like, space debris or something. 
Okay. Wait a minute. Press E? Are you kidding me? Don't tell me I could have done this the whole time. That's ridiculous. I didn't even have to. I could have just selected it. Well, I guess it's kind of cool. I got to... <laughs> I got to figure out how to do it manually. What the hell is this in the distance? Oh, crap. I'm almost hitting something. What? It looks like some type of core or device or... the hell is that? Okay, I guess we're gonna scan it. Oh shit, what the hell is that? Some kind of space worm? Did it just hit us? Yeah, I'm not seeing it anywhere. What the hell was that? Alright, let's select the next destination. Okay. Oh, that's cool. You can see it turning on the screen. Okay, so we're going this way. Let's see what we're looking at. Because I don't know what the difference is between the brown dots and the green. Wait a minute. Is this it? What the hell is this? What the hell is that? Like a little meteorite? A piece of space gum? Oh, I'm not even aiming at where I need to go. Okay, let's get it up. Right. Nope, down, down, down. Should be, yep, right there should be good, I think. So we gotta go down. Is that it? I have no idea what the hell I'm looking for. And I'm not aiming at it again. Okay, let's select this. Let's let it turn for us. I guess this auto finder thing is a good idea. The auto alignment. Mm, the ambient noise just got really deep. There's got to be something here that I'm missing. Oh, there's, like, crates? Transfer objective inside space lab. Press T. Okay. So, I'm guessing I gotta go into the space lab now. Holy crap. Is it just me, or is it getting darker inside the, uh, orbiter? Alright, here we go. First time using this bad boy. In the airlock we go. Last time we found out we didn't need a spacesuit. Oh shit, what the hell? Did it it literally move the box in here? Okay. Ready for operation. I guess I have to come over here and press these buttons. Okay, operation scan. Oh, that's kind of cool. It's showing it scanning. Okay. What does it say? Oh, good. It gives me descriptions. Surface scans indicate that this package was manufactured millions of years ago. This information might suggest that this local group might exist long before our discovery. Huh. Okay. Uh, sample. Oh, okay, so it's literally taking a sample. Oh, shit, what's that? Okay, let's see what it says. We can determine that these are supply packages by sampling subjects within them. These packages likely came from a... St from a carrier cargo ship, though it seems that all objects inside were still intact, as if it has been in stasis. Huh. Okay, what now? 
Oh, and operation. Okay, so I guess it's gonna turn us back here. Gotta get out into the airlock. Alright, back out. And back upstairs. We gotta select... We gotta select the next piece. Wait, what's all that background noise now? What the hell is that? And I'm going to start peeking up here before I uh, walk up. I, I get the feeling something's going to meet me there one time. Okay, let's go to this one. Oh, type analyze. The green you analyze. The other one, I guess we put in the lab. Okay, sonar. Alright, let's see what we're scanning. Whoa, is this like a ship? Or a space station or something? What the hell is this? What the... It looks like it might have been a spaceship. I don't think I'm aiming at it now, though. I gotta turn left. Okay, let it turn me. Okay, so it is this. So, let's scan. Okay, no action available. So now I gotta get away. I guess we gotta go do the research. Got it. So we gotta put it in the lab, whatever this is. Probably another uh, space station or a uh, ship part. Oh shoot, I gotta go around this. Oh, what the hell? Is that literally a star? Oh no, it's a reflection, okay. Oh shit. Oh my god, that thing's coming right at me. That is like a space worm. I'm not seeing what I need to get. Alright, let's click on this. Okay, I'm a little off. Let's click on this again. Alright, we're directly looking at it. What am I going to put in the... Whoa, what the hell? Man, these asteroids are all shiny like they're metal. What the hell is that in front of me? That asteroid looks like a glob. Wait a minute. What's that red outline? This must be it. What the hell is this? Okay, let's turn. Oh, what the hell? What the hell is that? Alright, I added it into the research. Guess we gotta go down and check it. Oh, shit. I think we pissed something off. Oh, yeah, there's the worm. Holy crap. Okay, I'm closing this door. I really don't want to go down in here. I get the feeling whatever that is is not good. Okay, airlock. Oh, what the hell? It's like a starfish with an eyeball. That is following me around the room. What the hell? Okay, I guess I gotta scan it. Alright, it's scanning it. Let's see what this thing is. 
That is so creepy, it's literally looking right at me and following me around the room. Okay. Initial surface scan unable to determine biological structure. Results suggest this life form is highly sensitive to light particle and have ability to freely transform at will. Oh. So instead of, it's not really a starfish, space starfish, it's like a ditto. What the hell? Oh, it's not going to like this shit. That's got to be drilling into it. And it's looking at me while it's doing it. All right, let's see. Unable to fully sample objects organic tissue. Data result that it also... Oh, shit, something's about to hit us. Oh, God, it must be that worm. It also poses high tolerance to physical interactions and excellent regeneration. Okay, let's end the operation. Oh, shit. Did it end up getting in the lab? Oh, that worm is messing. That worm or whatever it is, space snake or whatever, is really messing with us. All right, let's get out of here. We got to get up to the control panel. Mission says select new destination. Open door. Please don't be up here. Okay, there's nothing here. All right, lock the door. Don't want any surprises. And we gotta choose next destination. Let's see what happens. I could have swore I was gonna see something come at us. I'm surprised with the graphics and everything. This game is actually putting me a little on edge. Oh, yeah, look, there's more damage. Okay, let's go to sleep. Oh, no. Oh, holy crap, there's a lot more damage. What the hell is that? Is that breathing? Oh, yeah, there's... Okay, so the ship is getting damaged when we go to sleep. Oh, shit. Look. Look. That thing, like, broke loose or something. Oh, no. Oh, shit. Am I gonna see something up here? Okay, go slow. Hello? No, there's nothing here. Oh, there's that resin everywhere. What the hell? Oh, what the hell is this? Where are we? What the hell? What is that, like... Particles? Air? Don't tell me we're in that worm. What the hell? I'm guessing I follow the particles to get out of here. Yeah, it looks like that worm might have eaten us. This is really strange. Alright, these sides are really easy to hit. Be careful. Keep away from it. Yeah, that looks like organic tissue moving like that. Oh shit. Sonar. Okay, which way do I go? Oh god, what's that? Ah, okay, down here. Got it. going okay scan again no no scan wait a minute what the hell what are those strands wait what the hell is that a pod of some kind that is really strange okay I guess we just ah okay we're getting out of here what is that supposed to be, like a wormhole or something? Oh, okay. It says select de new destination. Can I keep moving forward? No, I think it's going to take forever. All right. Let. Uh-oh. Did you hear that? 
there was something growling. Okay. Holy shit, look at all that damage. Alright, let's close this. This is not good. Alright, I guess we're gonna go to sleep. all of this okay oh what okay I guess we're just going to the star if that's even what that is you know what I just thought of something what if this is a creature like an angler fish and that's that little light on the end or something trying to lure us in. But it's like the space version of that. Okay, let's keep going. See what happens. I, I don't think this is going to end well. Oh, shit. See, it's like a, it's like a black hole or a wormhole. Something strange reach the star and it has a question mark okay yeah we're definitely gonna die there's no way okay let's keep going oh shit what the hell is that oh no um why is everything red Oh, holy shit. Are we inside that creature? Wait a minute. While we were sleeping, did it take us out? Because it said it could turn into anything on that little thing. That it has, a, like, transformation, like, shape-shifting type abilities. God, it's dark down here. Holy shit, everything is red. Okay, I guess... Yeah, these buttons don't even work. I guess I have to go down here. It's the only way I can really go. Oh god. This does not look good. What the hell is... Oh, okay, that's the airlock. That's so weird. What the hell is this? It's like a heart or something. Whoa, holy shit! Did you see that? That thing had an eye. Oh, that was it? A long time passed and no signal was received. The only information regarding the orbiter is a sudden surge of astral particles detected in the center of the Delta local group. Before the command center could send a rescue vessel, the local group completely disappeared without a trace. The universe remains dark as ever. No star, no light, no hope, only despair. Was the air star somewhere, or is it just another trick from the astral abyss? Oh, shit. So it was, it's kind of like a, I guess that creature is kind of like a, like I said, an angler fish, but for space. That is really crazy. Hey, to the dev, if you are watching this or you see this, uh, I don't know if you took the class at university as an electoral, but if you were pursuing this as a career, keep doing it because that was actually pretty good for a solo dev development. Pretty decent game. The PS1 graphics are neat. Really good setup. You could tell that it's uh, inspired by Iron Lung, but definitely keep going. Either continue on to this storyline and make it bigger or... You know, join another group of devs or go work for a company even. I mean, holy shit. But yeah, guys, this game is called Astral Abyss. It's a really good game. Single dev. A student at university made it. Really good. I thought it was extremely interesting. But yeah, guys, just like and subscribe and I will see you in the next video.